Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. I hope you all are fine and staying safe and happy. I am your science teacher, Mr. Heen, and I welcome you all to your science class. My dear students, today we will start unit chapter number three that is flowers and seeds. And today I will give you a complete introduction of this chapter. So, my dear students, on page number 36, all the student learning outcomes are given, which are for the parents and the teachers to understand that by the end of this chapter, the students will be able to deliver, understand, explain all these points. So, my dear students, one by one, we will discuss them with the reading pages. So, plants as living organisms reproduce to develop new plants. Reproduction in plants is a multi-step process such as flowering, pollination, fertilization and germination. Each process has several steps. The following chapter tells us about all these processes in detail. So my dear students, living organisms, major plants hain, um, wo new plants jo hai, unko reproduce karte hain, jo reproduction ka method hai, wo bhi bahut steps mein aur complex cheez hai. Isi dhera plants ki jo seeds hain, wo bhi bahut complex structures hain unke, hum is chapter mein yehi discuss karenge. So, my dear students, the first lecture will be about, uh, the students will be able to examine and describe the structure of a flower. So, my dear students, jab hum first chapter start karenge, first lecture start karenge uh, chapter ka, to tamam bache jo hai, wo different parts of, uh, of a flower, they will be able to examine them and describe the different structures. ठीक है आप जो है एक फ्लावर के स्ट्रक्चर को समझ जाएंगे हम प्रैक्टिकली जो है वो एक फ्लावर को डाइसेक्ट करेंगे और उसके डिफरेंट पार्ट्स को देखेंगे सो दिस विल बी डन इन लेक्चर नंबर 1 देन वी विल मूव फॉरवर्ड टुवर्ड्स लेक्चर नंबर 2 एंड द स्टूडेंट्स विल बी एबल टू डिफाइन पोलिनेशन एंड डिस्क्राइब इट्स टाइप्स विद एग्जांपल्स सो पोलिनेशन क्या होती है आप उसकी डेफिनेशन uh, देखेंगे and you will give it, uh, explain it with examples, ठीक है? तो different types of pollination भी हम इसके अंदर पढ़ेंगे. The, uh, this is the reading pages 38 and 39 that are, in, uh, that are included in lecture number 2. Then we will move forward towards lecture number 3 and the students will be able to define reproduction and differentiate between sexual and asexual reproduction. So my dear students, in lecture number 3, आप जो different reproductions, the types of reproduction है, flowers के अंदर और plants ke andar sexual and asexual reproductions hain hum unke bare mein jo hai wo discuss karenge so this is the reading page page number 40 and in lecture number 4 the students will be able to describe the structure of a seed and demonstrate its germination to hum different jo seeds ke structure hain jaise ki monocot or dicot ye kya hote hain internally iska structure kaisa hota hai hum dissect karke bhi dekhenge और इसके अलावा ये जर्मिनेट कैसे करते हैं हम उसके बारे में भी डिस्कस करेंगे लेक्चर नंबर 4 में दिस इज योर रीडिंग पेज पेज नंबर 42 एंड 43 देन इन लेक्चर नंबर 5 द स्टूडेंट्स विल बी अगेन एबल टू डिस्क्राइब द स्ट्रक्चर ऑफ सीड एंड डेमोंस्ट्रेट इट्स जर्मिनेशन सो हम फर्स्ट लेक्चर जो इससे प्रीवियस लेक्चर था लेक्चर 4 उसमें हम मोनोकॉट सीड्स को देखेंगे और उनकी जर्मिनेशन कैसे होती है देन इन लेक्चर नंबर 5 वी विल डिस्कस अबाउट द डाइकॉट सीड्स एंड हाउ दे जर्मिनेट this is the reading page, page number 43. Or, we will comparison bhi karenge monocot seeds mein aur dicot seeds. Mein. Then, we will move forward towards lecture number 6. And the students will be able to compare and contrast the structures of function of chickpea and maize seed. So, we maize seed and chickpea seeds. Jo hai, unke jo hai, kaise they, how they, what is their structure? We will compare karenge aur unke mein comparison karenge. And in lecture number 7, the students will be able to illustrate the conditions necessary for seed germination. And seed ko germinate karwane ke liye kaun kaun si jo uh, situations hai wo important hoti hai. Kaise kaise hume us environmental factors dene chahiye taake seed jo hai wo properly germinate kare. Hum isko practically perform karenge. Aur aapko bohat maza aega. Aap dekhenge ki seeds jo hai within days kaise germinate karte hai. Kya kya chizhe unki jo hai wo sab se pehle uh, aapko nazar aayengi. Or kaun kaun si conditions aap unko denge or nahi denge to kya hoga. So this will be done in lecture number 7. And lecture number 8 will be the review of this chapter. Um, tamam pages ko revise karenge, tamam concepts ko ek revise karenge. Then I will provide you with an assessment sheet so that I will evaluate you. So my dear students, you will learn a lot of things from chapter number 3, flowers and seeds. Um, stay tuned for lecture number 1. Keep everybody around you safe. Have a good day. Thank you so much and Allah Hafiz.